Ah! <laughs> Hello, Winterians! YouTube Winterians. The Winterians on YouTube. Random story time! So, I have a lot of weird food allergies, and a lot of them are spices, like garlic and, um, rosemary and such. So we've been branching out to other spices, trying to find things to compensate for the stuff that I can't have. And one such spice is thyme. And we've had this jar of thyme in our pantry since my husband and I got together, which is like five years now. And we decided, hey, we'll open it and try the thyme and see how it is. Um, but since we've been using so much of it, we're kind of running out now. Like it's, it was full like a few months ago and we're just getting kind of low. I didn't realize this until I started making these really corny, we're running out of time jokes that um, this is not actually my husband's time. He got this from his grandmother, which is glorious because now I can say things like running out of borrowed time. Oh, come on. That's funny. So I've been wanting to do regular YouTube videos for a while now because I really enjoy talking to myself. Um, and as you might have noticed, I've fancied down my YouTube page and put thumbnails on my videos and made it all nice and I've figured out how to do better lighting so you can see me. In honor of finishing the first draft of book three, I decided I'm finally going to take the plunge and I'm going to commit to doing more YouTube videos. Now on, you can expect from me weekly YouTube videos. I'm crossing my fingers because We'll, we'll see if that happens. I'm going to aim for weekly YouTube videos, but that is my, my one of my New Year's resolutions at the end of January, is to two weekly YouTube videos. To kickstart that, I'm going to start uh, what will probably be one of the regular YouTube segments is uh, Q&A sessions, because uh, I get a lot of uh, questions from you guys on Twitter and Tumblr and everywhere, uh, and I think it's more fun for me to blabber on in person in these answers than to just respond on Twitter. So if you do have questions for me that you want me to answer in one of these videos, uh, leave them in the comments or uh, tweet them to me or Tumblr them to, or Tumblr them to me. Make sure you hashtag them Q&A so I know not to answer them on Tumblr or Twitter. Um, I'll do about one question per video so they're going to be super short videos like two three minutes tops because I have a very short attention span and I'm sure most of you do too. And for this first video I'm going to do a question that I've gotten many many times. Um, I actually have have uh, kind of answered this on my Tumblr. If you go to uh, sarahash.tumblr.com uh, slash snow like ashes, there's a link at the top called uh, looking for the pronunciation guide, I think it is. Because a lot of people ask me, how do you pronounce the names of your characters? Because it's a fantasy and it's ridiculous to pronounce names and fantasies. But it always is extra nice for some people to hear the names instead of just to read them. Let me add a little disclaimer here. These are not the right ways to pronounce the names. These are just the way that I pronounce the names because there is nothing more jarring than saying your favorite character's name one way and then hearing the author say it another way and what, what is life? What is the meaning? So if I say a name one way that is not how you've pron been pronouncing the name, just c carry on your merry way and keep pronouncing the name how you would pronounce it. Uh, I'm just giving you these pronunciations in case you just have absolutely no idea how to pronounce something. The first and most obvious character is the main character, uh, Mira. M-E-I-R-A. Kira with an M. Pronounce it however you want. I say Mira. Do your thing. <laughs> and then the boys are Mather and Theron. Theron's dad is Noam, and they are from the kingdom of Cordell, and their capital city is Bethai. The capital of winter is January. The capital of spring is April. Um, uh, the main bad guy is Angra, and it sounds like Angra with an A, but it's actually uh, the name of a uh, ancient Iranian god, uh, Angra Mainyu, who's the god of darkness from Zoro 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 Zoroastrianism. I think I said that right. Don't quote me on that in this pronunciation video. And the people Amira meets in the spring work camp are Connell, Garrigan, and Nessa. And I think those are all the main weird names in Snow Like Ashes. Oh, and then, <laughs> obviously, how do you pronounce my name? Because I've had a lot of people try their little hard, their, their hardest, and you know, more power to you guys. I'm sorry. Um, actually, my that's my maiden name. Um, the one that's on the cover, my author name is my maiden name. My married name is something super easy, and people always ask me, why didn't you use your married name? And I say, well, because I wanted to make it really hard on you guys. Uh, but the name on the cover of my book is Sarah Rash. It's German, It's that's the American pronunciation, because my family's American, and we say it like Rash, like Rash. That was super fun growing up with a name that sounds like a disease. But the correct German pronunciation is Rausch, I think. But yeah, so now, now you know, when Sarah Rash. Think itchiness when you think of me. 
And there's a lot other weird names in Ice Like Fire, so I will do a video like this for Ice Like Fire once the book is out and such things are relevant. Uh, but until then, yeah, send me questions, please, or I will keep babbling about things like time, and nobody wants that. And they don't even have to be questions about about Snow Like Ashes. I mean, they can be. If you want, you can send me like spoiler questions, and I'll try to do like one big collaborative Snow Like Ashes spoiler video. Maybe towards Ice Like Fire's release, I'll do something like that. Some kind of like burning questions from Snow Like Ashes about things. Um, so yeah, send me those questions if you want, or send me questions about publishing, or questions about life, or questions about Avatar, or questions about Lost Girl, or TV shows, or anything. Everything. Send me questions, please. So yeah, that is it. And stay warm, guys. On behalf of all Winterians, I apologize for the snowmageddon that has hit the east coast of the United States. Um, Life is rough being a Winterian, but at least there's cool hairstyles. <laughs> See you later, guys. So, we're here.